Okay, so I wanted to just come on here and show y'all my Bantu knots. Next time I'll do the video, I'll start from the very, very, very beginning. But anyway, I just took one out. It's already set up. Let me show y'all the curl to it. Actually, let me turn it this way. And please forgive me because I'm holding my phone, so it's hard to... Okay, so here we go. I took this one loose to show y'all. But the curl is very tight. As you can see. I think y'all can see. I can't even see the camera. But um, I put them in and I set them using uh, just rubber bands. Basically, I just wrapped the hair around itself and hold it in place with rubber bands. The only product I use is an all-natural product, and it is by 22nd Century Natural Products. She is online at the Morkit, morkit.com, that's M-O-O. R K E T dot com 22nd century natural woman and her products are all handmade all natural um this is a twisting cream it has shea butter mango butter olive oil chimano oil jehova oil i don't never say that name right sunflower seed oil and vitamin e and it's just a light white uh Excuse my hair in there. <laughs> but let me show you. It's just nice and white like that. It's out of focus. There we go. A nice, just creamy. Creamy natural product. And I just basically, I took one loose to just show y'all what I do, really. When the hair is not. When it's not twisted up like that, I just grab it when it's like that. And then I'll just basically rub that twisting cream on there like that. And then I'll take some water. I just run water on the faucet, wet my hand, and then just, you know, basically massage that cream into the hair. Just to put some moisture in my hair. And just keep wetting it up like that and twisting it and twisting it and twisting it. I basically just twist it. I sit in there and twist it around my finger while I watch TV or do something. And you can see the cream like squeezing out a little bit. So you know what's in there. I add the water to basically lock the moisture in the hair. So anyway, just keep twisting it like that. And then once I get it twisted tight... And you see how it's kind of like squeezing out like that. Once I get it tight like that, then that's when I'll wrap it around itself. I mean, I'm using one hand to do it, but basically you just kind of wrap the hair around itself. And keep wrapping it till you get a little ball. So again, I'm doing it one handed, so I really can't show y'all, but you get the gist of it. It's, it would be a two handed job. So just wrap it like that. You get a ball, then you just get your um, rubber band. Just get I just get black rubber bands like this, and I keep them in like I wet it down with like oil or something. I'll put something on it so that the rubber band is not tearing out your hair when it's in your head. Everybody think you can't put rubber bands. You can put the rubber band in your head. Like what I do basically, that's why my container look a mess. Cause I just throw everything back in there. I throw the rubber bands in there and sometimes I'll spray it with like oil sheen. So I let the rubber bands sit and the rubber bands are nice and moisturized as well. And then you just put the rubber band around your head. Just like that. And just keep 
you know, and it'll hold it in a little knot like that, as y'all can see. And I just do the whole head like that. I'm oh, sorry about that. There you can see I can do the whole head like that. And then when I take it loose, it looks like that. And then also you can go even further and I'll just show you real quick. Open this up even more and just wear it truly. Oops, sorry. <laughs> 